This morning, Big Blue Nation is mourning the loss of one of its own, 20-year-old nursing student Ann Gieske. The Kentucky native was killed over the weekend at a Halloween celebration in Seoul, South Korea. Tyler Melito spoke with a University of Kentucky mental health specialist to see how the school is helping students in their grief. And in speaking with that mental health specialist from the UK's Office for Student Wellbeing, there were two main takeaways. One, this is a family that is grieving the loss of one of its own. And two, they will get through it together. Every person is different. Your own personal histories are going to um, say a lot about how you react in these situations. School leaders at UK are answering calls from students struggling to cope with the untimely death of their classmate and Gieske. Sometimes students um, honestly don't know what to do and they, they just want to walk in and be able to sit down face to face with someone. Gieske was one of three students studying abroad in South Korea when the deadly crowd surge took her life. We have been able to find um, local therapists um, for our students there if, if, the, if they need more support than what we can provide um, either remotely through Talkspace or other resources here. Whether students seek out help or not, school leaders are stressing the importance of supporting those around them. Um, I would say have our, you know, our fellow students checking in with each other, um, you know, thinking about ways of getting together, um, recognizing again, everyone reacts differently, so not everyone is, may want to do that, but. As you just heard, students can go online for help for the university has a new partnership with online counseling service Talkspace along with its own virtual mental health counseling service. We have all those details up for you now on Fox 56 news.com for Fox 56 news. I'm Tyler Melito.